While I do not know if Hunter's head will be smashed right away, I do know that some heads will be around here. Some that Hunter or Scorpion might not care about quite as much. Speaking of... Will you look at that? Beautiful. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. My space station will soon be at firing strength within minutes. And you're the one who made it all possible. I don't even know if it's possible to thank you enough for this. Within minutes, just mere minutes, the Mushroom Kingdom and soon Earth will be reduced to nothing but scraps. The Orbitual Void will be opened up with all the negative energy that'll come to surface at such a sudden rate. Bah! I didn't do as much as you. You're the one who designed the space station, the SOPDPG, our servant. You are the one who came up with this whole grand scheme. Still, I can't believe you actually ended up sparing that other realm. A servant of the Sphere of Order resides there. Hmm. The dimension known as the Force Sector is a neutral zone. It would be a waste of time and solar energy to shoot at that place. It holds no value whatsoever to open the Orbitual Void. Once the Void is truly open, we shall become unstoppable. You know that. Yes, but all Devious Four are needed to open it. It won't be long before the Enlightened become the... Enlightened, you know. The Sphere of Order is not to be underestimated. You know that. Once that happens, they'll be able to truly destroy the Devious Four. As long as I'm around, that'll never happen. The Enlightened will never even see the light. They'll never awaken. That'll hold true within the next 30 minutes. The SOPDPG will shoot and eradicate the Mushroom Kingdom and two of the Enlightened along with it. In which case, we will gain ultimate power. Not even the Sphere of Order could stop this. Taking a triple take. Do you feel that? Yes. It is a very unsettling feeling. It's Mario and Sonic. They're on the station. Yes. SBDBG is starting to get disturbed. This could be a problem. Then let us deal with it. Ooh, this is a sign. This could be good for me. Definitely bad for them. Yeah, of course. It's good for me. I definitely want them to suffer. Hopefully Scorpion can be smashed even sooner than we expected. So as we enter, try to board. We'll try to stop their plan to destroy a world. Because yeah, it's just a world to them. Probably, well, then again, that neutral world, as, as they described it, I guess it would be just a world to them. On the other hand, no, no value to them. So, maybe not even considered a world. Just something that's around. Okay. Okay. Down. And I forget. Well... Didn't seem to be too much value to that at this time, but maybe later. Whoa. I gotta... Whoa, hey. Wait, oh, oh. <laughs> Silly me. Switches that blend in yet again. And this blends in way too much, I am assuming. It was right there all along. There was an invisible coin block, too. Rewind. I'm stuck. I'm going to have to go around like this. Invisible coin block again? And now I'm just going around. It's not even slippery, and yet something is happening. Oh, and I still forget. You go around like that, past that one-way wall. If I'm getting lost, I sure hope Scorpion and Hunter are getting lost as well. It's not gonna fire yet. Well, well, Mario and Hedgehog of Blue. He's red right now, but sure. Do you not remember who I am? Do you not know where you are? My SOPDPG. I see what I just did there. I sincerely hope you remember Hunter's capital, the clones. Well, don't fret. No more to miss them, for they are eager to see you too. 
Oh no. Oh no. Here they go. Wait. Um, does it open just when I get close to it? And I'm hearing that sound again. Is that because of this hunter right here? Because of specifically that color of hunter? Can I... No, still too slow there. Ah, scorpion and hunter cooperating. What a picture. Let's try and reach. Because we got more invisible coin blocks, unfortunately. Spin jump. And there you're gone. Good riddance. Oh, and that still fires even though... Even though... Very close to it. Another invisible coin block? You really... They're really pulling out all the stops to make sure I cannot escape. Yeah. Still not quite there. Burn, Scorpion. Burn. You just got fooled that time. Multiple halfway points? I'm not so sure about that. But here we continue. This might still be long. I recognize this. I recognize the music, if that could be any indication. In terms of which level I played before. Okay, run. Run right into these clones. Or drones. Drones, crones, whatever. Jump to the next room. There was another halfway point, but it was already picked up. So Scorpion and Hunter needed halfway points to that. Now that is pathetic. They're such cowards. They really are. And this really takes the cake for them. They'll probably figure out how to go even lower than that, though. Another jump there. Pressing that switch. It's this way, uh, but around like this now, instead. Run! Okay, there's a sign for the DPG. I'm just gonna switch this tail like crazy. To a point, anyway. And now maybe a duck. Okay, uh, so I can kick the shell. I can gladly take that. I'm not willing to take this hit, though. Alright, another statue's gone. Hunter's gonna keep reappearing here. That'll still be a pain. Up. Something. Things are appearing and disappearing. It's just that effect with the Magikoopa once more. Alright, reload. Reload. One more reload should do the trick. Apparently not. One spin jump definitely did the trick. Ah, goodness. Well, for all the stops that Scorpion and Hunter are trying to pull out, I will do the same. And I will guarantee my own victory. Well, actually, our victory, Mario, Sonic, and all the rest, once we see them. Nice knock out the shell. Even more appear. Kick. Sometimes you can knock the Magikoopas out with the shell, sometimes you can't. I still... Must be just the right pixel again. And this is probably no exception. Spin jump. No. Nothing like that. No, not that either. Come on. There. Has to do with the aim as well. Just direct it to the right spot. Direct yourself to the right spot too, so you don't land in the spikes. And still, don't land in the spikes. You master that already? Unfortunately, with all the invisible coin blocks here, I have an increased chance of doing so. Oh, uh, goodness. Wait, wait, wait. I forget which... Okay, it was that way. 
So you just gotta trigger it like that. I think I saw something something change down below. What is it now? Well, of course it's Mario's turn and gravity is back to normal. Seems like we're gonna... Sounds like we're going to meet up with Scorpion again. We have a choice of two paths, I think. Um, oh, this is probably just a bonus room. So... Um, what about the other one? This one gonna have a heart, or is it just for the mushroom or the fire flower? Appears to be just for the mushroom or the fire flower. Either way, you're ending up down here again. Oh. I must see uh, bony dronies, whatever. Be so well hidden. Scorpion hunter, you're boring. Add some color to your life. Or at least proudly add some color. Sonic's going to do it with a little. Okay. And now Sonic and Mario are out. If you really don't want the color, we won't give you any color anymore. Except for possibly all the blood that somehow rains down upon you from all the machines. How that'll happen, we'll have to find out later. But next time, the Hourglass Hour.